Hello, the Brick Neighbor here with a new video about my new train tunnel. Train tunnel with a little cliff, a little house on it. The last tunnel I did was a little too small. I will show you a picture now. As you can see, this tunnel is a little bit wider, it's a little bit bigger. The problem with the old tunnel was that uh, the train gets stuck sometimes. And uh, that's because the train track that it's supposed to cover is in a bend. I can show you right there in the back. That's the part it's supposed to cover up, the hole in the wall. And as you can see, it's a bend, so the track has to be wider. Or the tunnel has to be wider. I am uh, very pleased with the result, how it looks. Uh, a second time around building a cliff makes it a little bit easier. Forming a terrain is still very difficult in LEGO. Um, I took the advice of someone to make some, si some sort of a path up to the mountain so that it's believable that there's a little house. This also was a great opportunity to incorporate this Lego set onto the mountain. As you can see I think it, uh, it works very well. I removed the little pond there where the guy is supposed to be fishing because uh, I think a little pond on top of a train tunnel isn't very believable. Well, I'm going to uh, put it in my city now and see how it looks. Well, and uh, there it is in my city. As you can see, it's a very tight fit. The train barely passes through. I think it's quite nice how it turned out. Well, let's see some trains going through it. As you can see it uh, works perfectly. I'm very pleased with the result. Um, this is it for now. Stay tuned for more videos.